you have been tough against this team in the past. Right. Now you're going to join <laughs> for forces. For better or worse, I guess. <laughs> well, yeah. I, would, I wasn't going to go there, but. Yeah. Well, we ever play L.A., you know, me and CP know all the tunnels, so we'll be all right there. But, uh, no, nah, it's, it's funny. that it, it, This is a team I've always admired and wanted to play for in terms of, you know, D'Antoni, the way they play, getting up and down. Um, so, you know, this, this is a very fitting place. Um, so I'm very excited to be here. Tunnel thing, but Rockets fans are very familiar with their competitive spirit. You've right. had some big games against this team and against some of these players. Right. Is that I think strange I'm more, to get back. No, I think I'm more. I think I've only had that with these guys because they're like me. You know what I'm saying? I think I've gotten into it uh, competitive-wise with these guys because they're just like me. I think I fit more so with them than I do with a lot of other teams. Uh, they have a lot of guys who have that competitive dog spirit. Uh, Chris, James, PJ. That's their makeup, you know what I mean? Um, so uh, I'll definitely fit in, I think, very well here just in terms of me competing and, and wanting to do everything I can for the team. What was your relationship like with those you know, James and Chris before? Well, I've, I've always known Chris. I was at Chris Well, I played with him for three to four years. So I have a relationship with him. I played with Eric in New Orleans. Me and, both, me and Eric were both uh, out there. Um, I played on the same AU team as Brandon Knight. Um, I grew up playing against Mike Carter Williams. At this point, when you were in the league for like seven years, you just, you know people everywhere. So it's like, uh, in some way, I, sh I trained with John Lucas, crazy ass for <laughs> After my rookie year, he had me up here for like a month, and then I left, I couldn't do it. I was like, I gotta go. <laughs> he, he was trying to kill me. Um, but no, I know him, he's great. So I, I have familiarity with everybody on the team, so it's pretty cool. So Mike says you're gonna get some minutes tomorrow. How much can you accomplish, you think, in practice? And getting along in LA? Yeah, that's, that's, I don't know, that's you guys. That, 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 I had no problems with Chris, as you guys can see. Obviously, if I had a problem with Chris, I wouldn't be here. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Obviously, Chris has a huge input uh, on the team, as he should. He's a, he's a Hall of Fame point guard. So, you know, obviously, if that was that serious, I wouldn't be here. You know what I mean? So that just goes to show you right there that it's not real. I worked out with him this summer at the Dwayne Wade Stance Academy that uh, Dwayne Wade had um, in L.A. So, yeah, that's... That'll be quickly put to bed, I guess. Kind of like the secret tunnels that every player in the yeah, league goes through. Yeah, right, right. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> like